Pilbara resident Harry Mills hasn't seen his sons since the mid-1970s. The Injibandi elder is over 80 years old and wants to find his family before it's too late. I got a cry for them. When we finish crying, then we stay there together. And I gotta tell them story, what happened. When he was about seven, Mr Mills was stolen from Injibandi country in the Pilbara. He was taken 700 kilometres away to the Carnarvon mission. Still, we gotta stay in the mission. Locked up in the, in the house, dry bread and water, two pillow, blanket, no mattress. As an adult, Mr Mills yeah. worked on stations in the Midwest and Gascoigne and started a family. I had a son, and the son was Robert Mill. Next year after, Trevor Blower was born. In the mid-70s, an elder visiting Carnarvon recognised Mr Mills and forced him to return to his country in the Pilbara. Tie me up, check me on the back of the truck, take me to Onslow. And I was crying for my kid. Mr Mills hasn't seen his two sons since he was taken back to the Pilbara. With failing health, he's desperate to reconnect. An Indigenous service that reconnects survivors of the stolen generation with long-lost family will visit Roeburn this month, offering Mr Mills what could be his last opportunity to find his children. Amelia Searson, ABC News, Roeburn.